Well, uh, I guess I, ideal Philippines for me uh, uh, would be um, those uh, kids or youth who are qualified, who are determined, and who uh, uh, wants to go to college uh, should be able to go to college regardless of their financial standing. Uh, I think uh, education should be available to all, regardless whether you're rich or you're poor. Um, I think the only criteria is really determination and uh, willingness no, to, to finish school. I think that's the ideal Philippines for me. How about, sir, uh, your thoughts on where the Philippines would be in 10 to 15 years? Um, I think my ideal Philippines will be the improvement of quality of life. Uh, over time, we have to improve the quality of life for all of our constituents, uh, whether it's education, day-to-day -day life, um, crime, peace and order, we have to improve it. And a lot of OFWs, now, if, if you go to the States and talk to our uh, Filipinos who migrated there, a lot of them migrated because of the quality of life. It's, it's human nature that you want a better quality of life for your, for your kids, for your family. Maybe hindi sayo, but definitely for your, for your family. And that's what's lacking here in our country. And we have to keep on improving that by investing in infrastructure, education, and, and healthcare. So you think, sir, that's uh, realistic? Uh, it, it's hard to say. No? It, really de it really depends uh, on the next administration. It really depends um, what the next administration will do. But uh, definitely, in the next 10 to 15 years, we have to improve the quality of life of our constituents.